different qualities to the conscious and unconscious aspects of mind. There's a conscious mind that I'm going to make a cup of coffee. So my unconscious mind would then start to fire up the longest, strongest muscles in the body, in the thighs, the gluteus maximus, then I've got to put my hand here, then I've got to get out of the chair, and all that. That's done by my unconscious. My conscious mind puts forth the program, my unconscious goes, oh, I'm going to do that. And then I don't even think about how I'm going to get out of this chair. I might groan, <laughs> uh, but I don't think about it. I'll then start having conversations with people. So these things that we do easily and naturally, we put forward the conscious directive and the unconscious obeys. And usually we don't think about it.